Hey everybody, I'm fishing. <laughs> you see there's a remnant of that little storm that's passing through, but got a bit of a window, so I said, screw it, I'm coming out here. Got all my uh, mullet buddies all lined up here. The wind kind of pushed them against this edge. So we're just gonna do a little bit of prospecting, take a look. I haven't been out on the water in a week, so I don't know where anything's at, what it looks like. Don't expect a lot because the water's pretty churned up, but we'll see. I might throw the net right here and see if I can get one of these mullet, put it on while I troll out. So that might be what we do. Now, although there's a full line of them all along that edge there, it's pretty deep and these guys will be fast. However, I'm seeing some running up in the shallower area. So I might throw over in that area a little bit better chance. I'll get one throw and then they're going to disappear and be very difficult to get. But I really don't want mullet right now anyways. I can catch them on the outside if I want them. Got the five foot net. Don't need much more than that. Yeah, that works. See how fast they scattered there. But these guys were in shallow. They're pretty far away. Not paying attention. And they done got got by the five, <laughs> the uh, five foot uh, net. Uh, wow, this guy's a mangled one, a zombie. I just want that one, so we'll go from there. Oh! Could have whacked it, jumped twice. but I think I lost them on that second jump. I've got pieces of a fish. Yep, whackered. <laughs> we are out here at Shark's Channel, all alone. Outgoing tide, getting close to low tide. It's very thin, I almost got stuck in there. I'm gonna cruise the edge. I'm gonna try to see if I can net a couple uh, mullet. If not, I got uh, I got my good old trusty nine incher. So we're gonna see what we can do out here. Got a couple of wild beasts inside here. Ooh, lots of beasts up. There they are. That's not good. What are you guys doing in here? Okay, we're getting close to the magic hour. I see not as much mullet, but I'm seeing a decent amount of schools lining up along the edge. Getting down to a low tide, which is good. A lot of birds out here. Saw those dolphins out here. Saw a couple of uh, tarpon rolling, but not a lot. But I generally don't until that sun goes all the way down. Got a bit of cloud cover right now, but we'll see what happens. Well, well here comes all the mullet. They're coming out of the edges there. That's all mullet right there, all coming this way. But just not seeing really any tarpon coming. We're busting on them yet, at least. Being that this is the first afternoon after a week of blowing, most of the tarpon had moved out and were gone until this uh, settles down a bit. And then probably the next day or two, they'll start moving back in, hopefully but we still might see some action. This is about right. They're just starting to move out now, so keep a lookout. The pelicans have moved in, so they know the schedule. Now where's the tarpon? Well, that's the day, or actually the night, because I stayed out there pretty late. I just wanted to see what kind of action was going to happen. And it was pretty uh, lackluster, uh, but that's kind of usually what happens when we get some bad weather or the temperature drops. Those tarpon will take off, and it takes a good day or two to three days before they actually cycle back in. I did see a tarpon rolling. I saw some in the, the basin, and I saw a couple rolling out in the uh, current. Um, I got two bites throwing the artificial uh my reaction was just way too fast and basically i could tell by they were grabbing onto it but i was pulling it out of their mouth i could feel it 
Uh, that's just more me being premature about the hook set. Gotta let them take it for a little bit and then set that hook. The good thing was is that those uh, new um, corkscrew hook keepers held so I didn't lose any baits. So the soft plastics worked all the way through and uh, even with those two bites. So that was good. Um, but yeah, decent night. I mean, it salvaged it. I wasn't expecting to be able to get out today, but uh, when that storm or that uh, system just all of a sudden dropped off to nothing and then it was flat calm for the evening, it was, it was a worthwhile. So now I've got everything loaded, which is good. I took a test drive, so I know I got all my stuff. So we're ready for the rest of the week. So anyways, uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you next video. Bye.